The Brainerd boys baseball team posted a 16-9 record last year after returning only two of their starters. And as far as the roster stands this season, it doesn't look any different. Our Chelsea Brown has more. Last year's season for the Brainerd baseball team ended as a section runner-up, just shy of a state appearance. Well, last season we ended up losing in the section finals. It was a tough loss, but we did better than people expected. Two walk-off losses in the section championship. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. It's tough, but we're, it's in the past now. Although the team would like to replay those games, they're moving forward. This year, numerous upperclassmen fill their lineup, but not many have a lot of varsity playtime. They were here in practice every day, and they played quite a bit. Quite a few of them did, but just two guys actually played all the time. We're just looking to step up as kids who haven't played much in the past year. Similar to last year's team, only two are returning starters, but many of the younger players saw time on the field pitching, which could contribute to one of this team's strengths. This year we could have a little more depth in pitching, which uh, could help us in the long run, which section tournament is a uh, double elimination, so we could have a little extra depth pitching that way. I think pitching, I hope so, uh, and um, hitting you never really know. I think our defense will be good, our outfield especially, and uh, we're strong at short and second, so I think we'll be fine. But they refuse to call this a new team. They've grown up playing ball together and will continue to gain that experience needed to improve game by game. When it comes down to it, it doesn't really matter. You know, we're only as strong as our weakest link, so we're going to go out there and play like a team every game. In Brainerd, Chelsea Brown, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.